Hi, I'm Jesse, and I'm joining you from Canberra, Australia. Now, when I'm not studying science communication at the Australian National University, I'm actually a bubble wrangler. And today, I have a demo for you that shows us that bubbles can reseal themselves because if they can avoid popping, they will. They'll try and keep their sphere shape. To do that, I need my bubble lasso, and it's right here. Now, if you don't have one of these at home, that's okay, because you can make your own out of a wire coat hanger. Just like this one. You can also make some bubble solution out of a bit of dish soap and some water. The dish soap helps the water spread apart that would normally be sticking really closely together. To show you that a bubble can reseal itself, we're going to make a bubble within a bubble. You might predict that the outside bubble would pop, but with a few short sharp breaths, we can see that we can get some bubbles inside. That's because the outside bubble is trying to keep its sphere shape. It's the easiest shape for bubbles to form and if they can avoid popping, they will. Let's see it again. Remember, you need to use short, sharp breaths to get your bubbles trapped inside. I run a strict capture and release program though. So I'm going to let those bubbles go back into the wild. Enjoy the rest of your science show and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.